Gary is the go-to man for us. His wealth of knowledge for almost 25 years in racing comes from starting as a factory suspension technician to mechanic to crew chief in later years. He has worked with many world-class riders. <laughs> Jules began his racing career in his home country of France, getting some solid experience aboard 125 cc machines he made his world championship debut in the french gp with a wild card the 28 year old made his way through the ranks riding in the mota 2 world championship and in 2010 spending two full seasons in the intermediate class and he was able to make a steady progress 2016 saw the frenchman finish runners up winning twice with five podiums Welcome, happy to have you here. Thank you. A round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. Our next racer, Thomas Gradinger. After a strong, yes, there he is. After a strong World SSP appearance in August, this young Austrian rider Thomas is set to debut in the FIM World Supersport Championship in 2018 with NRT. Impressing around the German circuit of Loves Its Ring, qualified in the 17th position and crossed the line in the top nine on board the Yamaha YZFR6. Enough to impress his new manager. He now looks for now behind this sheer spectacle and success of our NRT lies a top flight of people. I'm going to mention their names. Andy Renders, Andrea Ballerini, Johnny Gill, Steve Spires, Thomas Kobiak, Frank Hurholz, Vasco Markov, Charlie Waite, who's a tire technician, and Ella, who's the team hostess. The 2018 season kickoff 
will happen in Phillip Island in Australia at the end of February with our bikes looking their best flashing in fry colors. It's a very proud moment for India where we will be showcasing our patriotism and enthusiasm towards our origins. We will now open the forum for the press. Uh, my humble request that make sure that you are asking questions related to this event. Thank you. So we shall start with Wafi. Yeah. Do we have a mic behind? Wafi, my question is to you. What inspired you to start the team as such and what was the inspiration really to start the team? Could we have the mic on please? Can we have another mic? Hello. Uh, firstly, thank you all for coming here. Uh, all of your support it really matters to us. Uh, for the team, initially, you know, जैसे हम लोग बोलते हैं, living in Bombay, हम लोग सब देखते हैं चीजें बड़ी-बड़ी bike घूमती है. You see, you see on TV that people are racing. You know, even me as a kid, it started off the same way. It was a dream. One day become a racer. Probably someday, you know, take our country somewhere where people have not been. So basically, that was the inspiration when I went when I moved to Dubai. And when uh, we saw that there are opportunities here, so that's the time. That was my inspiration. Okay. Uh, next question is, what does NRT stands for? Sir, uh, NRT. The full form of NRT is Nerds Racing Team, but that's the team actually what we use in uh, the local championships, what we compete in Dubai, in Bahrain. So NRT is basically, it's, not, it's the sister company of the Nerds Racing Team. Yeah. Uh, to both the racers here. Can, do we have a mic behind? Can you please raise your hands if you're asking a question? Haat upar kijiye please. Haan. Yasmin, how do you feel uh, being a woman and you know become owner of the team? How responsibility is, uh, is affecting you? I mean, are you taking the responsibility as such? I'm sorry. Can you say it? Being a woman, yeah. how does it feel to become the owner of the uh, team as such? Okay. Uh, first of all, again, thank you all for coming. And uh, I feel like I am blessed, I am proud that um, I got the opportunity to uh, be a part of something so great and uh, I feel like uh, this is a male dominated uh, profession and being a woman if I can be a part of it and uh, if I can help my husband and my team to uh, get you know great great winning in each and every race then I feel uh, it's a very proud moment for me and uh, being a woman as you said if uh, I think I can encourage more women to uh, come forward and you know do something which you believe in no matter if it is uh, something that people will feel like it's not uh, meant for women and uh, you know it's just riding is for bikes they are the best for it so I think uh, all the ladies out there, we should do everything that we can do that we can do that we can do that we can do and if we believe in ourselves, then I think everyone starts believing in you. That's all. Thank you. One question here. Yes. How do you see the team performance this season? I'll be honest, we have the best team. I mean, my husband, Buffy Khan and me, and especially with the help of uh, Mr. Gary, uh, we have managed to get the best people for our team. And uh, we are happy that we have both our riders. And we, I, we look forward for the best. I think this year, uh, the championship can be for uh, NRT. So yeah, we hope for the best. Fingers crossed. I hope you all pray for us that we win. <laughs> Thank you so much. Uh, my question is to Thomas. Thomas, how does it feel to uh, be in India and what really, I mean, how does it feel like? 
Uh, yeah, for first of all, uh, really nice that so many people came here. Um, it's really an uh, interesting country and um, I'm excited to uh, get an invitation to come here. So, thank you. And yeah, I'm happy to be here and explore a little bit the country and also the people here. Uh, my question is to Julius, is there any special strategy for the Philip uh, race, forthcoming race as such? Any special strategy for you, the race? Any strategy for Oh, yeah. Hello, everybody. Uh, thanks also for the invitation. We are happy to be here, as Thomas said. Um, for Philip Island, for sure, I'm looking forward to this race because uh, we'll be the first of the season. Um, the new challenge with um, uh, NRT, uh, Indian team, and uh, for sure, I'm looking for the best. Uh, the best for, for me will be to win the race. Um, I won few times there, so the strategy is to be ready. We have some tests before. Um, for me, we'll be the first time with the new bike, the Yamaha, and um, and for sure, I'm looking forward to test the bike and uh, and to win the race if possible. I will be so proud, and uh, I think, as uh, Yasmin say, um, they will be proud of that. So I want uh, to make them happy to have me on board. Uh, next question is for Gary, the manager uh, of the team. How much work was needed to prepare the team for this season? Um, a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot. We, we've been uh, working day and night from Indian side, or let's say Dubai side, European side. We've been working hard to prepare everything, to make deals with sponsorships, from technical to other ones. Um, it's been very hard to do it, but uh, Yesterday I was still in Germany and uh, we finished everything off. Everything is packed up. What will be picked up today and goes in the flight to Australia. But I can tell you it's not a job that you have to do every day. I will motivate you. See, uh, uh, to, to be part of this, and uh, to be able to support in whatever little way I can. It's a big thing. In fact, it's a very big honor that they have called me here. That's actually um, a very, I mean, it's an um, inspiring step that they've taken. Because these sports are not taken so seriously in terms of a career. So it's a very, like a new arena for people. So here is a talent in India, but to post to pursue it as a career, uh, koi chance ya koi platform nahi milta. So it's a great honor that they've, you know, Wafi and Yasmin, they've come up with this and they're supporting, um, you know, Indians and Indian teams and they're supporting all those bikers in India who've never ever got an opportunity like this. My favorite Actually, you know what? I have a lot of respect for athletes. Um, even childhood, during my childhood, uh, my mom used to put us in a lot of sports as kids. So we were into skating, we were into badminton, we were into swimming. I think that for a person's growth, mental development, emotional development, in every way possible, sports is very, very crucial. And it's very important that when you get a platform that you get to different um, you know likings and interests to explore kar sake. and uh, sport, sports actually keeps you very mentally fit emotionally fit it makes you stronger all the way around anyone else would like to ask a question yeah behind I knew that was coming. Yeah. I just knew that was coming. There's one that's already been shared. If there's anything else, I'm sure there'll be a final announcement regarding that. But I really want to celebrate these two, yeah, who are sit sitting here and, you know, um, making our country proud. Bilkul, sports is very important in schools. As I said, for children's development and all. Well, <laughs> <laughs>
अभी तक नहीं है लगता है आई अब आप ट्रोल हो जाओगे पे सबके साथ आपको ट्रोल होना है गांव के स्कूल्स में भी होना चाहिए एजुकेशन या एनी मोर क्वेश्चन नो He's uh, he's saying that under 19 has just won the World Cup. What is your take on it? Like every other Indian, I feel proud, and um, uh, you know it's amazing that beyond cricket, you know there's a, a yeah. lot of other sports that also gets captured and you know noticed, and people who are making us proud all over the world. It's just uh, inspiring and it's very motivational. Yeah. Thank you. Sir. कभी मौका नहीं मिला लोगों को यहाँ इंडियंस जो इतने अच्छे बाइकर्स होते हैं उनको कभी प्लेटफॉर्म नहीं मिला यू नो टू एक्सप्लोर दिस अरीना फॉर दम सेल्स सो इट्स अ ग्रेट प्लेटफॉर्म फॉर ऑल इंडियंस एंड इट्स अमेजिंग टू सी हाउ पेट्रियाटिक दिस टू आर आई मीन इफ यू सी दे ऑल्सो वे द बाइकर्स दे हैव लाइक आफ यू नो लाइक ट्राई कलर ऑन द यूनिफॉर्म एंड ऑल एज वेल सो आई थिंक इट्स इट्स अ ग्रेट 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 इनिशिएटिव <laughs> मैं बाइक नहीं चलाती हूँ अनफॉर्चुनेटली पर अगेन देर आर लॉर ऑफ पीपल हु आर क्रेजी अबाउट बाइक राइड्स एंड ऑल एंड आई थिंक इट्स अमेजिंग वी आर जस्ट ग्लैड एंड वी आर थैंकफुल फॉर वानी फॉर बींग एंड सपोर्टिंग एन आर टी टीम दैट्स ऑल थैंक यू ऑल फॉर कमिंग थैंक यू थैंक यू थैंक यू थैंक यू कुछ ना पूछते वाणी मैम मैम सॉरी थैंक यू नो प्रॉब्लम ओके थैंक यू